Who's the greatest guy the world will Wonka? Who's the greatest guy the world will Wonka? He may look like a kitty for a boy or girl so a daddy. Who's the greatest guy the world will Wonka? Who's the greatest guy the world will Wonka? Who's the greatest guy the world will Wonka? He makes lots of joys for lots of girls and boys. Who's the greatest guy the world will Wonka? Once upon a time, there was a boy named Charlie Bucket. He was not fast, not coordinated. His family barely had enough to eat. Charlie Boy Bucket was the luckiest boy in the whole world. He just didn't know it yet. Hmm. Grandpa Joe, look, I actually found. From went past Uncle's factory. Quartz is amazing. Quite amazing. We have cabbage soup for dinner, right? Went past Uncle's factory today. It was straight down looking at the factory. I think it was a tanker. Before it was looking at the factory. Before he looked, he said, Don't we go in? Don't we go out? Right, he was. Not since the treasure day will he walk and close his factory to the public. What did you do with that? With all the other factories. Can you make it a and spies to steal Willy Wonka's secret recipes? Especially Slugworth. Slugworth was the worst. If I was a Wonka shot, I'll be ruined. I'll have to close the factory. That's what happened. He locked the gates and he bashed completely. Then about three years later, the most amazing thing happened. The factory started working at full blast. More delicious kitties than ever before. The gates still out said no one. Absolutely no one could steal Willy Wonka's secret recipes. Someone has to be hollywood aboard the factory. Thousands have been held in Ward's factory. Who's holding them? That is the biggest mystery of them all. They just came and came and Mrs. Bucket from the factory. One from the t oh, look what I found. I got the evening newspaper. It says, Willie Walker's opening his factory to the public. It's quite amazing. And I read the first article that we found. Um, the person will probably be fat, fat, fat. Sure enough, enough the first golden ticket was on the next day. Hmm. Here we have, uh, have the winner of golden ticket number one from Dusselhoff, Germany. Boy, Gustus Gloop. I, I find a golden ticket that day. So I thought, candy? No cut? No eggs? I find a golden ticket. How do you really feel? I don't think you're good. And, and we're a repulsive boy. I can't believe this. Then pretty much everyone was, was looking for searching for golden tickets. And the second golden ticket was found by a girl named Veruca Salt. What's her name? Veruca Salt. Oh, I, and Veruca found that golden ticket that day because I knew she'd find it. Uh, I'm the PF business, so I took her to say, Where's my golden ticket? I want my golden ticket. Uh, this is your father, she's all smiles again. Then, and we have a happy home. Then, pretty much next, it was Charlie Bucket's birthday. Uh, happy birthday, Charlie! Happy birthday! Look what we found. Um, um, we should have a grandma Georgie, our grandma Josie and me. I mean, that piece of little tasks. Here's a little gift from Grandpa Joe and me. It's a walk bar. Oh, but let's see. Let's see. I got it. Let's see. Well, you didn't I? I had it. Never mind, you'll find it. Uh, you're really right. No, no. No, no. Then. Then we'll be hold the tickets three or four of them. Mm -hmm. Um, won by Bob, Bob Borgard of uh, uh, Landville, Mississippi. I thought I'd find a golden ticket, it'd be quite amazing. When I heard about this golden ticket, Lance got such a kitty worth his dead. Man, I'm not gonna come. I just adore coming, and I sit behind my ear. This guy worked on a three month solid. That's a record. Remember, it was Corey Fitzgerald, and why is she mad? 
Falls the girl. Wait, it's just then. We just found the fourth pool in, in Los Angeles, California, by Byte TV. Several algorithms of 4746. 4746. If the other way, I had to buy one bar. I feel like it. I don't know. I don't really like chocolate. Four down and one to go. And who will find this golden ticket? Uh, it can't be ten to be burned or losing. Why should you be up, Grandpa? Something wrong? Grandpa? We bought a ticket. We got a kid bar? Probably worth it. What ticket? Let's find it. So it's supposed to be lucky. I got a funny feeling. Which I show up first. Then I just a bit. This? Not a bit more. You do this, aren't you nervous? When you open. Right. Here goes. You know, I bet this gold takes for the chocolate taste terrible. Pretty much the snow began to fall all of that and it was terrible. I thought the fifth gold was found by someone in Russia. But the turn off your fake. Oh Charlie, here's the ticket. You found Walker's last golden ticket. In my shop, I don't believe it. Uh, I'll buy it for you. One million dollars. There's no two million dollars. Go straight home and don't let anyone have that ticket. Go straight home and don't stop till you get there. Look, everybody, you found the golden ticket. It's mine. For all the legs. Is this one of your jokes? The last one's a fake. It's this one of the papers. If that's why you buy a golden ticket. Reads you a lucky finder's gold ticket from Willy Wonka. This is ticket factory at the 10 o'clock or 1st of October. Do not be late. We we'll bring with you one member of your own family, but no one else. We're going to see great surprises with what managed. Charlie, you've done it. I can't believe it. Grandpa, I say you should go. Oh, don't you think you should go? I'll go definitely. We're going to take a break, but we'll be back a while, so don't mind go anywhere.